This is a video showing how I adapted my metal lathe for use in ornamental turning. I initially replaced the hand wheels with similar sized pulleys. I added brass spinning handles for them and it has the same feel as unmodified. I also removed the compound and replaced it with a block of inch and a half steel to which I mounted a quick change tool post. I added a inexpensive magnetic digital readout. A bracket was made for two small stepper motors and fit to conveniently located holes in the cross slide frame. Once belts are attached and slightly tightened, the lathe can still be used in manual mode. I also made a mandrel to fit in the spindle. This has to be a fairly tight fit and a third stepper motor was mounted to that. Of course, the belt for the motor has to be removed. Then the belt can be installed for the rotary axis. I also need to mount a chuck from my wood lathe. And the easiest way is to put a one inch, eight thread per inch bolt in the metal chuck and spin on my wood chuck with the work I've previously turned on the wood lathe. I made the quick change tool post adjustable. I can easily remove it and move the mounting bolt back in my uh, lump of mounting metal. I also made some uh, simple tool post mounts for my 800 watt DC spindle. This one is for using it in the vertical cutting mode. As you see, the tool post can be easily slid in the T slots. And I also made one for mounting in the horizontal cutting mode. The clamps for the spindle motor are a little bit tough to get apart. So I drilled and tapped a third hole for a jacking bolt. So once the nuts and bolts are loosened from the clamp, this can be turned in and the clamp will be spread. The motor can be easily changed to the other motor mount. The stepper motors are all connected to some electronics. On this one I have two different firmware cards, one with gerbil running on an STM32 and a USB version for Mach 3. There are three stepper drivers, a main power supply and a power supply for the spindle. Here's a brief bit of action with the spindle cutting at two rows in the lid of a box. I hope you enjoyed, enjoyed my adaptation.